The earth along with the other planets revolves around the sun in its orbit and the moon revolves around the earth in the moon's orbit. There comes a time when the three heavenly bodies earth, moon and sun get aligned in the same straight line. This is when an eclipse occurs. There are two types of eclipse, solar eclipse and lunar eclipse. First, let's see what is solar eclipse. Solar eclipse occurs when the moon comes in between the sun and the earth. As a result, the moon blocks the light of the sun from reaching the earth's surface and casts a shadow on it. Solar eclipse can be categorized as partial, annular and total. When the moon does not align completely with the sun and so only a portion of the sunlight is blocked from reaching the earth is called partial eclipse. Annular eclipse occur when the moon covers the sun but the sun can be seen around the edges of the moon giving an impression that the sun is a bright ring surrounding the dark disk of the moon. Total eclipse is when the sun is completely covered by the moon. The sky becomes so dark that it appears to be night. Only a small area of the earth can witness it. Now let's see what is lunar eclipse. Lunar eclipse occurs when the earth comes in between the sun and the moon. As a result, the earth blocks the light of the sun from reaching the moon's surface and casts its shadow on the moon. It occurs on a full moon day. Lunar eclipse can be categorized as partial and total. Partial lunar eclipse occurs when only a part of the moon moves into the shadow of the earth. Total eclipse occurs when the earth passes directly in front of the moon and casts its shadow on the full moon.